All right, now let's talk range loss, people. You can see my car's got 109,000 miles on it. I'm just starting its towing career now at two and a half years and 109,000 miles on it. It's, I've got the 90D, so it came with 259 miles of range from the factory, but let's see where we are right now. I've been supercharging forever, and it keeps saying 10 minutes. It doesn't even move. I don't even know if I can get to 239, and that is taking forever to get these last couple miles in. I must have been sitting here for a half hour, and I picked up three or four miles, maybe. I am not kidding when I say that. So I am guesstimating that my range loss here is going to be, I'm thinking the maximum I could ever get if I waited for another hour or more would be like 239. And that's totally impractical to do that. You know that, totally impractical. But if we go from the rated 259 from the factory to 239, that means I've got like a 7.7% range loss, I'd say, something like that. So maybe let's say 8%. I don't even know if we can get to 239. It might even be more. It may be more like 8 to 10%, really, truly, realistically. But you got to remember, I've also done almost all my charging on superchargers. I've supercharged like 11, 1,200 times, something like that. i got to check the app to get the exact number. But we'll figure between 8 to 10% uh, range loss. And I hope it doesn't get any worse. That's the thing. And especially with towing, oh, boy. Let me know in the comments what you think is going to happen to my range when I'm towing, long-distance towing, what's going to happen with the battery life, uh, range loss, all that. Love to hear from you in the comments. And type in the number, if you own a Tesla, what is your range loss? Type that in the comments, just a number, percentage number. You don't even have to put the percentage. Just put like 5, 10, 20. I don't think anybody's that high, right? 4, whatever it is. And I'd love to see what, uh, what yours is.